Today I will be showing you all how to get Instinct and Vesaber Sword in Blocks Fruits, and also Vesaber V2. Now the reason why I'm doing them both in one video is because you need Saber for Instinct. So now let's get to the video. Now I'm on my ult to buy Instinct on this account. For some reason I did not know this but I already did the puzzle but don't worry I could still show you. So the requirements for this is to have 750,000 money, level 300, and to get Saber if you want Instinct. And now the first puzzle will be 5 buttons on this island, so make sure you're on jungle and the first one will be right here by the rolling. And then the second one should be on a tree somewhere, over here. Yep. By the way, the buttons won't be green for you since I already did them. Another one will be by the bush over here. And finally, the last two buttons will be on this small jungle island over here with a, where the gorilla king spawns. On this tree is one, and then by the docks over here is the last one. And then for step two, come over here to this middle building here, go down here, and then grab a torch that's right here. Once you get the torch in your hotbar, you now have to go to Desert Island. I'm gonna do a cut to Desert Island, but from this docks, you just go past Middletown to get there. Now that we are here, go into this building here with the red door with your torch and there should be a door here that's blocking your way when you have the torch make sure to burn it out of your way and then grab this cup right here and now step three will be starting so now for step three you have to go over there to snow island and go into a cave i'll do a cut but from these dogs just go over there and now that we are here go inside this cave here make sure to hold out your cup and go under this leaking icicle. Now make sure the dot's going directly into the cup, otherwise it won't fill up. You'll know if it's filled if the cup has blue looking water in it. But once it's filled, go back out here and go up here into this building here and talk to the sick man. The sick man should say this, please meet up with my son. I'm sure he will reward you. And then that's where step 4 starts. Now for this step, you'll have to go to Pirate Village and talk to the rich man, which is all the way over there. From the docks back at Snow Island, you could travel straight ahead and go to Pirate. And then once you're here, from the docks here, go over here to the rich man. And from when you talk to him, he should say, go kill a mob leader or something because he stole his relic. So then you go over here to this island and you kill the mob leader. So real quickly, just kill him. And then once you kill him, you'll have to go back to Pirate Village and talk to him again. And then once you talk to him again, you should get the text that I got, which gives a relic. So now onto the final step for Saber. Now the final step for Saber requires you to come back to Jungle Island. And put the relic into the door over here. There should be a relic hole looking thing right here on the door, so you put it in and this will open. And you just wait for the Saber boss to spawn, if he isn't spawned yet. Once you kill him, there will be a guaranteed drop to get Saber, so I'll cut to that part. Some things to help to know about Saber is that he is a pretty difficult boss, so you do need a good stat build, I suggest using mine. My stat build is more damaged, so just make sure that you don't get hit by Saber. And then another thing about Saber is that he spawns every 30 minutes, so I suggest going into a private server. Because someone could kill him other than you. Now let's get to the cut where I fight him. Alright, and now he finally spawned. Now this one, even though it's level 200, is a bit difficult. So try and play your distance and be careful with it. But as you can see, once I kill it... I'll get the Saber because it's guaranteed. Alright, now before we move on to the instinct and how to upgrade part of the video, I'm gonna real quickly suggest joining my Discord server. When you join my Discord server, you can trade with other people, get the current value of each fruit in Game Pass, and get the combos for your fruit. Which, not gonna lie, needs some more combos, so please help with that. You can also get the link to a private server I bought just for y'all. If it gets too crowded, I'll buy a second one. You can also join giveaways, get stock updates, and get better new video notifications. That is all I have to share, so thank you for staying. So now to get instinct, 
you need to make sure to get all the way up there on Sky Islands. Now, obviously, some of y'all don't have flights, so I'll just show y'all how to, like, teleport up there. Oh, wait. I mean, up there. <laughs> My bad. But first of all, you just head over to Sky Islands. If you're on boat, just start climbing up the stairs to up there. And you need to go on this island right here, on the lower part, and go inside here to teleport up to the upper Sky Islands. And now that you are here, start heading all the way over here to this looking temple kind of building. And now inside the temple up here should be the instinct teacher. So talk to it, then buy it. And make sure to stay because I will explain to you how to get Saber V2 and how to upgrade your instinct. Not to V2, but like to upgrade your dodges in general. Hello again. Now don't worry because I'm not sponsored so this is not another advertisement. There is a new code that I want y'all to enter for 2 times XP before it expires. The code will be FIGHT FOR FRUIT. All caps put in this right here and redeem for 20 minutes of 2 times XP. That is all and I'm sorry if it is expired when this video comes out. Now first let's talk about upgrading your Saber to V2. First you need 1 million bounty and then you have to kill a person similar to your level. Once you do that it will say that something weird has happened to your Saber. Now why would you want Saber V2? Well it just makes it more overpowered. It makes the moves more bigger and it also changes the visual effect of them. I'm not sure if this is also true, but I think it upgrades your damage on it. I'm not sure, though. Don't take that as a fact, alright? And then finally, for instinct, all you have to do is just dodge. Oh, I'm a Logia to that. By the way, Logias won't work. At least if you, like, have the effect on them. But for these, you just have to dodge, and eventually it'll upgrade the number to give you even more dodges. I'll put up a list of the XP requirement for each, like, kind of dodge level. And the way you check how much XP you have on Instinct is by going back to the Instinct Teacher. 8 is pretty insane for how low it is. Now before we cut to the outro of a video, if you need help with stuff like Money or Instinct V2, I have other videos for that. Not Instinct V2 yet, but I'll be making one soon. But there is definitely a video for making money on my channel, so go check it out. And if you have any other suggestions for a tutorial, I will be happy to do some. Alright, thank you for watching my tutorial, I hope you followed it well, and I hope you got both of the things. All I have to say is I'm sorry that the puzzle was already completed, but hopefully it was still clear to follow. So, I'll be seeing y'all later.